Did you know that your mind is the most powerful supercomputer that has ever existed? And your mind is capable of things you don't think are possible. And once you start ruling and guiding your own mind, everything changes. And I want to give you a quick uh, visualization exercise that you can use to become a lot more powerful and and when I heard this it kind of changed the game because uh, when you just wake up like 30 minutes and uh, 30 minutes before you go to sleep that's when your brave your brain goes into theta waves so the brain and, and our human mind they they work in different wavelengths it's brain waves and they are different levels uh, between the conscious mind and unconscious mind and the the bridge the gap between those two minds are called theta waves so you have a small window of really easily change your subconscious mind and that's where the real power is because that's what essentially rules our our days our our minds our lives like 95 percent of all that we do all our limiting beliefs all our our systems our habits our behaviors are located in the subconscious mind so the exercise is super simple I want you to remember things when you've been like extraordinarily happy and felt powerful and, and you've been you've been proud of yourself and, and everyone has these moments throughout our lives and it doesn't matter if if it happened when you were five or if it happened when you were 15 or, or just yesterday the more you can tap in to these memories that makes you feel good and makes you feel powerful the more you rewire your brain into becoming this person so it's it's the most simple form of, of brainwashing and you can do it to yourself and if you start doing this every day and I've been doing this for a week and, and I can already see so much change. Start remembering those feelings over and over again, even just for a, 10 minutes a day and, and go back into that memory and feel it and be proud of yourself. And that's gonna make you more proud and, and more powerful in this moment and when you repeat this you can't it, and this is kind of logical you don't give room for the the negative things and here's when it gets even more crazy even if you have negative experiences and you have like traumas or you have like memories when you weren't happy and, and, and you still may feel guilty or you still are pissed or, or whatever, you can actually rewire those, reframe them into a positive and that's going to make you a more positive being and that way the world and the universe will start showing you more positive things because we all are vibration and once you start vibrating you start seeing more potential you start seeing more opportunities and that's essentially how you climb out of the the shithole that you may or may not be in and this is how i've got myself out of 
feeling really bad and and depressed and anxious and and not happy about my life. So I feel an obligation to share this because some of these things can be so super simple and they have a massive change. And I think that's that's the biggest paradox of life and I guess life is a big paradox, but sometimes the most simple small things are the ones that really makes the biggest difference and yeah it's it's like therapy for yourself so try this out go back into a memory when you felt super powerful and and like close your eyes and imagine it and be like wow that one time i really overdid myself i'm so proud of it. i don't care what anyone in the world says that moment was the purest form of my own power and then you can try to to go in to a memory that isn't that happy and try go, go and see if you can find perspective or viewpoint that is positive and and maybe you benefited from that experience in a way that made you realize something or that it showed you your boundaries or or something like that and this is this is the power of the mind once you start tapping into it and start small start with the little things once you see results you're gonna be like wow and, and you get more confident and, and you start trusting yourself more and this this is essentially how you you change yourself and, and sure if you then add like guided meditations and and these deeper exercises and things into this it, it, it will have a, a even bigger benefit but I just wanted to share this small and very simple technique of just remembering and visualizing and feeling powerful stuff because your body essentially remembers stuff and and the more you repeat a good memory the more you basically prime yourself to being that and, and you will start achieving more opportunities to get into that same state okay i know this might be over the top for some people but this is my true real experiences and uh and as i said i just feel called to share about this and uh make the world a better place than we found it okay i really hope you have a nice day and stay cool peace out